Today, uh, we'll, we'll introduce how to set up for the uh, cloud printer about the link connector and the Wi-Fi connector. Actually, uh, this printer support the link and the Wi-Fi, also GPRS. And uh, today we just uh, uh, test the LAN and uh, the Wi-Fi. So uh, actually the, the LAN port is very easy. Just uh, need to connect. Connect the LAN cable and uh, only power on. The printer will, printer power on. will get the IP address from the server because it's a support TH, DHCP server. Let me try. Printer power on. When you see this screen on the this icons, the LAN icons, that will be and then after we I print in the self to test page and the printer will print in the IP address automatically. That means it's connected to the light bulb. So the LAN is uh, don't need to send, send it anything, just they need to connect the cables. Okay. Uh, next uh, let me try to set up the Wi-Fi. And send up send up to Wi-Fi, we need to use the USB cable and to connect the printer with your PC. Okay, power. And then we can use the printing power on printing setting tools to set in the Wi-Fi. Use the USB and enter the setting. Connect the Wi-Fi. Choose the Wi-Fi SSID. This ID is uh, for your local Wi-Fi ID. And also, you need to notice the capital and the small words. And there is a key. Tap your key. Then, click the setting. The printer will print in the printer power on. Setting your, your SSID lane. Okay, let me try to send in self test page. Printer power on. Oh, look. Okay. Printer power on. Okay, waiting with a moment. This is a LAN DHCP get IP address. Wait a moment. When the Wi Fi connector, it will be sure. IP address again. When you see this Wi-Fi icons on the screen, then will be the Wi-Fi is connected and also printing the IP address from your, your server, your DHCP server. This one is a name and this one is a Wi-Fi. Okay, now the Wi-Fi is connected. Now we need to connect the MQTT server. And uh, uh, we need to set in the server and the port 
and also the topical and the submitting topicals. Same, uh, we can try to use the another tools and QTT. Setting tools. Enter. Then I try this server is from is your MQTT server IP address. There also can support the demand demand rate. Uh, this is our server IP and the port and also username and the password. Uh, let me use the tools to set in the uh, MQTT information for the printer. Then this one is uh, our server IP address, our MQTT server IP address. This is our test MQTT server. Then I can set it. Order received. Order received. Okay. Order received. Order received. We can restart printing and uh, turn in the step to test the page. Printer power on. The server there is show the server connector. That means we the printing is connected to MQTT server. Now we can use the, the another two to test the, to testing the a printer. Then we can use the Java tools. When but the latest, this this tools must install the Java because it's uh, use the Java to uh, write So open the MQTT server and the port and then connect the MQTT server. This one the subscript uh, topicals means to get the printing status. So, just like this, this scanner, this QR code, where code, get the subscript to top, top code. Because the default is the same, so I don't, I don't need to scan in this. If you change, use the tools, change this, you need to scan it and get the top codes. Okay, so, yeah. And then, the publish top codes. Is uh, for each printer is different. So, is this one? This one, this bigger QR code is for printing printers uh, uh, topicals. So, we can try to type or use this cell phone to scan in the QR code to get the topicals. So, I can try to type it. Now we can try to use the tools to test in the MQTT server and the, the printing how to work it. Then open the because we use the MQTT server. Uh, this part information is for our uh, MQTT information: the IP address, port, and the name, and password. You, uh, because we are used our the default MQTT server, so don't need to ch change it. Just uh, uh, click the connector. After connector, and then what is uh, this printing success? This one is uh, for the uh, for for uh, 
for the print to get the printings they choose just uh, uh, like this you can if you change it you can scanning this uh, small QR code to get this uh, topical to uh, to get the printing statues and this one the speak QR code is for printing uh, uh, printers uh, topicals we can use this topical to send some message to printing to, to printer uh, and uh, printing some things okay uh, now we just need to change the published topicals there I use the scanner to scan the QR code you also can use the type the the topicals okay let me try we can you see okay uh, this topicals is shown on there now we can try to the, and also need to notice that there is a published QR code QoS. This is a default is a two, and uh, you can setting the printing also like this. Okay, let me try. Oh, so sorry because this is a long long talk. It's not this print. Let me try again. Scanning again. Okay. This is means working. So we can try to print in a. See, this one is a sample. You also because this uh, uh, this tool is made by Java, so you also can use this this sample API to check uh, how to send the data to the printer and uh, how to uh, make the development for by yourself. Okay, uh, this is all about the cloud cloud printing settings. Okay, this one.